Welcome to my YouTube channel. This is Sichamba Jeko. All right, so I've got this exponential equation which we need to solve. How do we get to find the value of x in this case? So for us to find the value of x, uh, here, the yeah, I'll say there are so many methods that you can use, but uh, I'll just go with uh, what I think is straightforward. So I'll just apply the log. So log, you can see the log there. I guess you know what it means when we talk about logs. So when you apply the log here, so you shall say log x, log of x power, x minus log of what? Of x, okay, there power 1 over x is equal to 0. So when you apply the logs here, I know we can use the properties of, uh, of the logs. Yeah, so the way we're going to use these properties of log, we'll bring these powers in front of the logs like this. And this is what the logs do. So it will look like this, equal to zero. I guess you know what, uh, what, what, what I've just done here. When you apply the log, this power will come in front. And this also power will come in front, and this is where it is. Now look at this. We've got uh, log x here, log x here. So we can even equate this. We can say x, or we can we can we can rearrange. We say x log x is equal to one over x log x like that. Okay. So this has just come this side. It's now positive. It was negative. It's now positive. So if you're able to see nicely, here we've got x is equal to x log is equal to log. Even x is equal to 1 over x. So I'll say x is equal to 1 over x. So now we solve, to solve for the value of x, we cross multiply. We shall have uh, x power 2 is equal to a 1. x power 2 is equal to 1. So thereafter, we can say x power 2 minus 1 is equal to a 0. We, we use difference of two squares. Or even here, if you wanted, you would have, would have just said that square root, square root this side, where we get x is equal to positive or negative 1. So the solutions for this uh, question, uh, they are trivial, okay? They are trivial. You can just tell even by looking that, okay, there are two solutions, it's negative or positive uh, 1. So if we use difference of two squares here, this is how it will look like. And when we solve these two equations, this one and this one, we're getting x is equal to 1 or x is equal to negative 1, just like that. So this is how you are supposed to answer this question. There is also another method. I'll show you in the next video when I make the video. So please make sure you watch each and every video that I upload on my YouTube channel. This is Sichamba Jacob.